Mr. Bigley. Hey there, guys and gals, it's Gerbeagly with another episode of Gaming with Gerbeagly, and I'm once again playing another random one-shot from over on Itch.io. This is a game called Scoot Scoot, and it was actually made for a game by its cover jam. It's a jam that's about a month long, and devs have to basically make a game based off of a, I believe, a Famicom game cover, which is really goofy. It's a very weird concept. But this one is about you just driving, like, this moped or motorcycle. I don't know what exactly what this is. I think it's a moped. But you have to go through, like, an obstacle course, and it's timed, and it apparently has very wonky controls. I'm using a gamepad to play this. I can accelerate with the triggers and then turn with the left stick. So this is going to be really interesting. Ooh, I like this. So I think this was built in Unreal. Um, I could be wrong. Ooh, okay. Wow, that is... <laughs> Ooh, okay. So this is really funky control. Oh, Jesus. Um, uh, how do I turn more? Uh, <laughs> okay, so you have to come to, like, a complete stop to turn. I'm not doing well. This is a bad thing. Oh, wow, okay. So I got that, <laughs> that next arrow. There we go. So you kind of have to, like, come to a complete stop to make your bike turn enough to... Oh, Jesus. God. Christmas Christ Kringle. Jeez. All right, this is not indicative of how I drive in real life. I swear, I promise. I know there's probably going to be a lot of Asian jokes, and I get that this takes place in what looks like Japan. There's, like, you know, the Japanese in the title, and then there's also the fact... What the hell is this? I don't know what that was. It was like a checkpoint. Um, and then, uh, oh, God, jeez. Ah, oh, this is bad. This is really bad. Okay, this is... Uh, cra turning is wonky in this. Like I said, you sort of have to decelerate or come to a stop. And then you can turn your bike more than the default turning while you're accelerating. All right, got it. So we're going to have to do that here. Oh, or not. Uh, back up a little bit. There we go. Yeah, let's run over a cone while we're at it. So the cones are adding time to my overall time, which is not good. It doesn't look like I'm going to beat the best time there on the course. Oh, Jesus. Come on. All right, here we go. Oh, God. Uh, oh, okay. It tricked me. I have to go this way now. That's fine. It looks like I'm still activating all the arrows. I like the, the music in the background, by the way really nice tune. Oh, Jesus, why? I'm, I was sideways. I almost, like, took a dump there. Took a dump? Took a sp made a sp spilled? I don't know how to... It bailed? Uh, what, what's the word for motorcycles or mopeds when you crash? Good God, those little circle ones are really tough. These ones are tough, too. Oh, God. I'm completely turned around. I'm a terrible driver in this game. This is really bad. Uh, I'm hitting everything. Wh what the heck? That one wasn't even, like, a true obstacle. I'd already knocked that one over. But the fact that I made contact with it, I, I fell over? Oh, God. Ugh, that flashing every time is going to be distracting. That's fine, though. We're doing okay now. Okay, so now I'm learning how to drive. I forgot any of the points I was trying to make earlier because I'm just concentrating completely on uh, just making it through this obstacle course. So we lapped one time. We have one lap. One good lap in us. And now we have to... Get multiple laps through. Okay, so we have to get at least three laps? Really? Oh, God. I don't know if that's going to happen. I've literally hit everything I could hit there. That was pretty horrible. Oh, God. See, that what, that thing was in the middle of the freaking road, and just because I ran over it again after already destroying it, it counted against me? That's some bullshit game. But I like it. I, I like this game. It's got sort of like an isometric view with the driving, but it's, it doesn't seem to interfere too much. What interferes is the goddamn controls. Good God, I'm just puttering around like an idiot, and it's super wonky to, <laughs> to look at. Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no. Get back on the course. Get back on the course, lady. Oh, my. I, I really like your motorcycle jacket. It's great. It looks very nice, but I would like you to actually be a good motorcyclist. I know I'm the one controlling you, but really, you need to be helping out, too. This is bad. All right, there we go. Oh, no, Jesus, God, holy Moses. I don't know if you can if you can actually crash, but if you can, then that's a bad thing. Oh, I remember what I was talking about before. I was asking, what is the terminology that people who ride mopeds use when they when they crash? When they, they take a spill, take a dump? Take a dump? <laughs> that's pooping. That's, that's a different thing completely. That's a different activity. But... I'm not very good at this. I can definitely tell this is not my style of game. It's a lot of fun, though. This is really cool. I, I mean, it's supposed to be challenging, I can tell. But at the same time, <laughs> it is so frustrating to play. It is wild. It's like a, a goofy ragdoll physics style game. And I, I like that a lot. The fact that this was made in a month is also really impressive because, like, it's got really nice music. It's got very nice graphics. It's obviously got some really goofy, fun gameplay going for it. But good God, is it hard. This is very challenging. I am going to see what my score is at the end of this. And then you guys, hopefully, will be able to challenge me to... Oh, God. Cra oh, God. Um, excuse me? <laughs> 
Okay, so apparently I fell off my motorcycle. I didn't know that was even possible to do that, but I went straight up in the air like I was dying. Like, my body had already died when I made impact there. I guess the most we can do is try again, and hopefully I can get a better time. But hopefully we can complete three laps this time. If we complete three laps, then I'll have a best of score that you guys can try to challenge and beat. So hopefully I can get to that point. All right, let's get to it, guys. Let's do it, and by do it, I mean not crash 8,000 times. This time I have a bit of an edge because I'm more used to the mechanics of this. Like I said, one of the, the best tips to use that I have found out so far is just sort of like slow and steady. You go in these like little bursts. Oh, God, that was bad. Don't, don't do that. Don't do what I just did there. But do little bursts of speed. Just accelerate a little bit. Oh, God. I, I don't want to bail again. I don't want to fall off my freaking bike. Oh, God. Come on. Come on, lady. Oh, don't hit all the cones. It's okay. Actually, hitting the cones is better than flying off the course and hitting something and dying. Oh, like that thing. Don't kill me thing. Whatever that is. The tree's in the way. Tree's in the way. Oh, Jesus. How did we survive that? I have no idea how we just survived that. But like I said, I have kind of an edge because I'm... I can anticipate the turns a little bit better and obviously uh, by doing so I can make these sharper turns by by slowing down appropriately and then oh, jamming on the left and the right of the of the thumbstick god it's still so hard to do though this game is oh god the tree why no 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 don't oh my god son of a freaking bitch and I'm dead in the Sakura blossoms there I didn't get to the end of the course let's try again guys <laughs> All right, this time I'm ready. This time I'm going to do it. This time I am going to be the master driver guy, man, sir, person, lady. It's a lady. It's a lady on this thing. But, ah, uh, come on. You, you make yourself worthy of this motorcycle, this cool motorcycle jacket you're wearing. Make yourself worthy of that by being a cool motorcyclist. Oh, that was cool. The, I didn't realize that the uh, Sakura Blossoms were actually falling off of that tree. I think that's a Sakura tree. I don't know. I'm assuming so. She has got, like, you know, the Japanese flag on her helmet, and there's this Japanese-sounding music, and there's all this sort of stereotypical Japanese stuff going on here in the game, and it's it's a super wonky, crazy fun time thing that you might see on a Japanese variety show, maybe. I don't know. I haven't watched Japanese variety shows in quite a bit, but I'm going to make the cliche assumption that that's what is happening here. Uh, oh, God, come on. Come on, stay on the course. Stay on the course. Oh, lady, no, 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 stop. No, why? I wasn't even... I wasn't even hitting anything that time, and she just decided to do, like, break dancing on her stupid bike. What the hell is happening there? It was ridiculous. Ah! All right, we're doing it this time. We are doing it this time. Oh, that somehow counted as two, even though I ran over that, like, cone thing. That's all right. That counted as two of the arrows at the same time. That's a, that's a quick life hack for you guys. I don't know how much these are adding on, by the way. Every time I hit one of these, uh, it looks like a 0.25 seconds, maybe? I haven't really been paying attention up until this point because I'm just trying to steer the bike more than anything. I just want to beat this stupid course. I don't know if there's more courses than this, by the way. This might be the only course, and if it is, that's fine by me because I don't think I could handle anything more challenging than this. This is a ridiculous obstacle course, and it's not even a true obstacle course. It's like, if you were to do this in real life, it'd probably be really damn easy, but the fact that you got this bouncy, stupid, crazy, dumb bike to deal with in this game... It makes it so much harder, so uh, I don't even care. I don't even care that I hit that cone. I made it through that part that time without going upside down or whatever the hell was happening before. Oh, God, yeah, I guess I'll just hit every single cone there. That's fine. That's okay. That's exactly what I wanted. Oh, make it right in between these. No, no, don't fall. Lady, don't fall over. Why are we stuck? Why are we stuck? Okay, that's fine. That's good. Okay, so now, now we can make it through here, making our way downtown, walking fast. All right, there we go. Or driving fast, I guess. There we go. Make it around the turn. And we are doing A-OK -okay now, guys. We are on lap two. This is as, uh, what, as far as we made it the first time, right? Or we made it to lap three, maybe? I don't know. We were a little bit slow that last time. Oh, our best time. Oh, I didn't even realize. Uh, barely over a minute. 13 seconds over a minute was our best lap time so far. And our total is only at 140 seconds. That is pretty damn good. I gotta say, I'm proud of me so far. Oh, Jesus, I'm not proud of me anymore. Why? I hit the curb. That's all I did. I've done that a thousand freaking times. I can't believe that just 
ah, this game is frustrating. It's a lot of fun though. It's super goofy and really funny, but the physics don't make sense. Okay, this is the last try, guys. This is the last one. This is all I'm going to allow myself. If you guys can beat this game and I don't end up beating it, then let me know what happens if there's a cool victory screen with explosions and awesome amounts of uh, cats eating sushi or something. I don't know what's going to happen at the end of this. Anything could happen. The world is this biker's oyster. And I still haven't discovered... Is it... I? People who know bikes better than me. This is one thing I don't understand with automobiles is motorcycles. I don't know if this is a moped or a motorcycle. Let me know in the comments. Or maybe it's even a, a special kind of dirt bike. I don't know. It's something or other. Okay, we'll hit all the cones there. That's fine. That is okay. As long as we stay alive, and once again, we don't do the wonky physics, then everything is fine by me. Look at that. Look at the skill. Look at that high level of skill. Oh, God. There wasn't any... Oh, what the front door? Why would you even go backwards there? Okay, yeah, that's okay. <laughs> Slow and steady wins the race there. That's okay. <laughs> we, we hit two of the arrows by going backwards. That is exactly how pro I am. I can drive backwards and everything's all right. Oh, yeah, made it through there. Oh, and that, I think, was our best lap time. It was a minute ten. Yeah, eat your freaking heart out, some motorcycle racing guy. I don't know anyone who's a pro motorcycle racer, so you can fill that joke in with someone's name who is actually good at this, who's not me. Um, yeah, there we go. Oh, and it looks like, I don't know if that takes time off of our lap or what that does when... We uh, go through those, like, gates there, those checkpoints, but it looks like it took time off of my total time, which is cool. That's really awesome. I, d I don't know if that's what it does. I guess we'll have to confirm once I make it to the next checkpoint. If I can, if I can. Why are we... We hit the curb again. We hit the curb again, and we flipped. That's... I don't know. I don't know how this game works. I don't know how it decides when you're going to fall over when you hit a curb that you're supposed to go over. I was going maybe... I don't know, two miles an hour? I have no idea. But apparently this game isn't going to allow me to beat all three laps, so I'm going to quit here before I explode and break my controller in half. You guys can try this game out for free. Like I said, it's on Itch.io. I'll leave the link down below in the description so you guys can tell me what happens after the third lap. I'm sure someone out there will have the tenacity to go ahead and beat this game. I do not have the patience for it right now, but this game is super goofy. I like it a lot. I like the presentation, the graphics, the music, everything about it was really fun i hope that you guys enjoyed watching me play it and if you did please be sure to hit the like button share the video and favorite it also be sure to subscribe to me if you guys haven't already for those of you who have thank you so much for all of your support you guys are the best in the world i love every single one of you and as always it was great seeing you bye bye Derp,